What's up, my friend? Welcome to this amazing day, my friend. You got to feel it, my friend. This is the most beautiful day you've ever been a part of, my friend. But first, you got to acknowledge it. You got to appreciate it. And you got to feel it, my friend. So you already know my question to you. Did you put on your amazing today, my friend? I mean, you can't leave home without it. No day is good enough, my friend. Did you put on your amazing today, right? I mean, there's nothing wrong with amazing, right? Amazing is available. It's accessible to all of us, my friend. So did you put on your amazing today, right? See, here's the thing. We all first got to get uncomfortable in order to get comfortable. So your skin in the game, your willingness to get uncomfortable is putting on your amazing each and every day. But here's the thing. The amazing is only to help you to be amazing, my friend, and to win the day. So if you ask me, that accessible amazing is a win-win. All you got to do is put it on, my friend. That is it, right? And if you don't put on your amazing, something has to be wrong with you, my friend, because there's nothing wrong with amazing, right? Right? But that's okay, my friend. It's okay. Something's wrong with you, me, and everybody else. We are all flawed. This is why you need your amazing, my friend. Right? Amazing. Will have your weaknesses become strengths, my friend. That's what amazing will do for you, my friend. So never leave home without it, right? And we're continuing with the same theme this year, my friend. The same theme. 2023 is the year for me, right? I know you said that. That was your resolution, right? And I heard you. I felt it. You were so passionate. You were so serious about that. I am just here to ensure that you win, my friend, in the first part. Is putting on your amazing, right? Because I can't put it on for you. Nobody else can put it on for you. That's the least you can do is put on your amazing, right? And I got another tool for you today, a real serious tool. This is a big tool. You got to put it in your toolbox so you can continue to be prepared for whatever may come your way. Whatever is trying to make you a loser in 2023. Whatever is trying to make you out to be a liar. You are here to say, take that tool. I'm winning this year, right? And you're not just winning a little bit. You winning by a blowout, a landslide, my friend. So here we go, right? Here's another tool that you got to remember to do, right, in order for you to ensure that you get a big, big victory in 2023. Before you can control something, what you got to first understand, you what you have to first know about that thing that you're trying to control is you got to first understand it, right? So in order to control something, you must first understand it. And I am here to tell you that you have to understand Your emotions, yes, your emotions, you got to understand them way, way, way better than right now. You're not where you need to be in understanding your emotions. Let me explain, right? See, allowing your emotions to dictate your actions is not the goal. Let's get that clear. That's not the goal. See, the goal is to allow your actions to dictate your emotions, my friend. That is where you want to be, my friend. That is the goal. This is why you must control. You got to first understand your emotions. Let's go even further, right? This will help you to understand your emotions. Your emotions, right? They are the fuel that drives your life, right? Your emotions are the fuel fuel that drives your life so you gotta always be sure always be certain that your life's tank is filled up with emotional harmony octane that's the kind of gas you need in your life my friend because your emotions must always be understood so that you can in turn control them my friend and here's three reasons why you must control your emotions right Number one, here's the thing. The universe is amazing. Let me tell you what it does, right? However you feel, 
is sent back to your life in physical form. I don't know if you understand how significant that is. However you feel is returned back to you in physical form so that you can continue to feel that way. And if you don't think that's enough reason to understand your emotions, then I don't know what's wrong, my friend, because you got to first understand them in order to control them, my friend. Right? And number two, here's the thing. Allowing your actions to determine your emotions can be accomplished through becoming addicted to progress, right? So now it's not, it don't come down to how you feel. It's all about how you perform, my friend. That is a better measure for your emotions than blindly letting your emotions walk you around and control your life because you won't win that way, my friend. Your emotions, our, all of our emotions, they misfire sometime. Emotions will have you impulsive, responding impulsively to every situation with no thought in it. Allowing your emotions to dictate your actions is not the goal, my friend, never, right? And number three, here's the thing. You got to develop a greatness mindset, a mind bold enough to believe, right? That you should never allow how you feel to determine what you do. I'll repeat that, my friend. You should never allow how you feel to determine what you do, my friend. You much better than that, my friend. You are a winner, my friend. You're going to win in 2023. In fact, you've already started, my friend. And you know what else, my friend? You were born to be great.